The product of two times a particular number can be visualized as two rows of that number of elements. The result will be the sum of the elements of all the rows. 2 times 1 is 2. 2 times 2 is 4. 2 times 3 is 6. 2 times 4 is 8. 2 times 5 is 10. 2 times 6 is 12. 2 times 7 is 14. 2 times 8 is 16. 2 times 9 is 18. 2 times 10 is 20. The product of three times a particular number can be visualized as three rows of that number of elements. The result will be the sum of the elements of all the rows. Three times one is three. Three times two is six. Three times three is nine. Three times four is twelve. Three times five is fifteen. Three times six is eighteen. Three times seven is twenty-one. Three times eight is twenty-four. Three times nine is twenty-seven. 3 times 10 is 30. The product of 4 times a particular number can be visualized as 4 rows of that number of elements. The result will be the sum of the elements of all the rows. 4 times 1 is 4. 4 times 2 is 8. 4 times 3 is 12. 4 times 4 is 16. 4 times 5 is 20. 4 times 6 is 24. 4 times 7 is 28. 4 times 8 is 32. 4 times 9 is 36. 4 times 10 is 40. The product of 7 times a particular number can be visualized as 7 rows of that number of elements. The result will be the sum of the elements of all the rows. 7 times 1 is 7. 7 times 2 is 14. 7 times 3 is 21. 7 times 4 is 28. 7 times 5 is 35. 7 times 6 is 42. 7 times 7 is 49. 7 times 8 is 56. 7 times 9 is 63. 7 times 10 is 70. How many are 7 times 1? Perfect. Your score is 4 out of 5. How many are 7 times 6? Perfect. Your score is 5 out of 6. Question mark. The product of 8 times a particular number can be visualized as 8 rows of that number of elements. The result will be the sum of the elements of all the rows. 8 times 1 is 8. 8 times 2 is 16. 8 times 3 is 24. 8 times 4 is 32. 8 times 5 is 40. 8 times 6 is 48. 8 times 7 is 56. 8 times 8 is 64. 8 times 9 is 72. 8 times 10 is 80.